Teratospermia, also known as teratosuspermia, is a spermorphological defect in which the spermorphology is abnormal. All men produce abnormal sperm without entailing a fertility problem. The actual problem of teratosuspermia is that men suffering from this condition have high levels of abnormal sperm, which means such sperm are unable to reach and penetrate the egg. There are two different criteria to assess sperm quality. Kruger Street Criteria Values under 15% of normal sperm indicate teratosuspermia. World Health Organization Criteria Values under 4% of normal sperm indicate teratosuspermia. To assess sperm morphology, the following parts of the sperm are analyzed. Head it should be oval shaped with a regular contour. The presence of more than 20% vacuoles may indicate a case of teratosuspermia. Midpiece. It is located in the middle and serves as a connecting element for the head and the tail. Its size is 1.5 times larger than the head and its thickness must be moderate between the elements it bends. Tail. It's the largest, thinnest part of a spermatozoon. Anomalies may occur in any part of the sperm. According to the most common sperm morphology defects, sperm may be double-headed, microencephalic, macroencephalics, abnormal-headed, without midpiece, with a too large or sifted to one side midpiece, with a too short or excessively long tail, double-tailed or with a strangely shaped tail. Although there are three different types of teratosuspermia, mild, 10 to 14% of sperm are normal, moderate, 5 to 9% of sperm are normal, severe, less than 4% of sperm are normal. It is possible to have children when suffering from teratosuspermia, but resorting to assisted reproductive technology is advisable. Available treatments are as follows. Artificial insemination in cases of men with mild teratosuspermia whose partner is under 35 years old. IBF in cases of men with moderate teratosuspermia or men whose couple is under 35 years old. ICSI for severest cases, that is, in cases of severe teratosuspermia.